destined to soar, a television news magazine that is dedicated to highlighting entrepreneurs and community leaders. Please join me in welcoming a returning guest. Ms. Keisha Lee is the CEO of Annie Malone Children and Family Services, where she has been for the past year. Almost or, a year. Almost a year, <laughs> but she's been there about four total mm -hmm. and you have just been doing a phenomenal job oh, so thank you thank you're you. welcome welcome back Keisha thanks for having me oh, always always your your work is so important and vital to this city that anytime you know you would like to come on you know you are more than welcome because you 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 um serve our most vulnerable population so just tell us about Annie Malone and the services. Yeah, it's all of us in this together. That's how I see mm -hmm. it. But the services that we offer, a lot of people mm -hmm. don't know what we do beyond the parade. So mm -hmm. that voice, so thank you for giving me a platform to sure. say that. We have a 24-hour mm -hmm. crisis center at Page Union. Mm -hmm. Those are my babies, all of yes. my babies. But mm -hmm. that program is for kids. Like we get calls in the middle of the night from Mm -hmm. social workers or cops, kids that parents may have overdosed mm -hmm. on drugs, have been killed or just in a bad situation. They bring them to us. We keep the siblings together, keep them mm -hmm. in home school. They get new clothes, new shoes, everything. Mm -hmm. But it's also a respite service for parents too. I always say there's no handbooks mm -hmm. to parenting. Yes. So we get calls from parents and they're just at their wits end, right? Mm -hmm. And we're like just bringing the kids to us. They've fallen on hard times. Yes. And just because a har hardship doesn't equal neglect. That's one yes. thing we have to make clear. So just because mm -hmm. someone is evicted, evicted from their home or something doesn't mean that they're abusing and neglecting their kids. Mm -hmm. So this is a safe space where they bring, our, bring their kids. They can come get them anytime they want, do outings with them and everything. And we help the family mm -hmm. uh, get stabilized. So we refer them to our parent education advocacy program. So that's for unification for parents. We're going to court yes. with them. Um, doing intensive at home. We also do prevention work for mm -hmm. parents that are at risk of getting their kids taken. Yes. So we do things through a uh, diaper bank, mm -hmm. uh, triple P parenting models, what we follow. Mm -hmm. We have parent cafe. It's a very strong program. Yes. And then we also mm -hmm. have our teen drug abuse and prevention program, our yes. safer program. So we mm -hmm. go into schools and we do mm -hmm. teen drug prevention as well as treatment. Yes. inside the school and then we also have mm -hmm. an evening program where they can come to us or we go pick them up I say come to us we pick them up it's free transportation mm -hmm. we feed them dinner and that's more treatment in the evening for teens mm -hmm. a great program and we also have mm -hmm. another program coming down mm -hmm. the pipeline mm -hmm. a lot of people know about our K-12 mm -hmm. therapeutic school but mm -hmm. I think Annie Malone has been able to stay in existence for 135 years because our ability to pivot yes and mm -hmm. meet the needs of the community. Mm -hmm. So the um, K through 12 therapeutic school, we're trying to, mm -hmm. we're changing the model after this year. Right now yes. we have a lot of crime with our youth. So mm -hmm. what we're gonna do is move towards this level up program mm -hmm. that's gonna combat that crime, sort of give the youth mm -hmm. a stable place to stay, more like a boarding school model. Yes. And we're building economic mobility with them. Mm -hmm. And all of our services have free therapeutic services Free, free therapy services. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I can't yeah. talk today. You're free fine. therapy services, yes. but but the Level Up program is really it, it's it's a game changer. I think it's a game changer. Yes. They come to us on Sundays. They're mm -hmm. doing laundry uh, mm -hmm. on Monday through Friday during the day. They're getting we're get tutors. They're going to go to like different Fresh Start programs to get their GED, pass their mm -hmm. high set test. In mm -hmm. the evening, it's more trade model. They're learning stuff to get a mm -hmm. job, like shipping and receiving mm -hmm. and forklift, different things like that. And then also they're learning to prepare meals themselves, like healthy meals, yes. how to cook and prepare for themselves. And on mm -hmm. Fridays, they get ready, they go back with their parents. And a mm -hmm. lot of people are like, well, why are you doing it where they go back? Because mm -hmm. family is everything to me. Yes. Keep that family mm -hmm. component. And it's not mm -hmm. a prison. Mm -hmm. It's just like more of a boarding school model. Mm -hmm. You have to be able to make good decisions without someone standing over you. And that's, that's what we want to, that's what we mm -hmm. want to come back. We're not here to split families mm -hmm. up. We're not here to, you know, mm -hmm always do the foster care we want to we, prevention it's prevention yes. services mm -hmm. and meet people where they are and it's no judgment mm -hmm. zone so yes. those yeah. are some of the good things that annie malone has mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. uh and i would say annie malone has a lot of great things going on there and you know and when i think about the like the community service model mm -hmm. for the city of st louis there are not a lot of programs that do what annie malone does no. you know that that serve children you know, from six weeks to 18, yeah. you know? Yep, we do. 
And mm-hmm. it's right here in the thick of it, in the heart of it. Yes. You don't have to call some mm-hmm. hotline or something. You need immediate mm-hmm. services like any Malone is right mm-hmm. here in your neighborhood. Yes. That's the, the, the good piece of it that mm-hmm. I really, really love. Like we won't sit mm-hmm. out somewhere else and then say we're helping this. Like we're right mm-hmm. here in the thick of it. Yes. Yes. Yeah. And it was it was a uh, testimonial that you told me about earlier this week mm-hmm. with one of your students that was in the crisis program, you know, who had who had never read or had never been to school. Yes. yes. So just an a yeah. example of uh, the, the mm-hmm. type of um, things that we encounter is that we have mm-hmm. an eight year old and a seven year old in our crisis program right now. They came mm-hmm. to us and they have never been to school. Yeah. So we were able to enroll them in school and mm-hmm. they don't know how to write their name and read. So the NAACP of St. Mm-hmm. Louis County gifted us uh, gift cards around right after Christmas. Yeah. And I was like, okay, I got to give these babies some leapfrogs or something to help mm-hmm. them write because the school is calling us. Mm-hmm. And I was able to go to Target with those gift cards and yes. get a t- $300 worth of like the books mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. everything they need to start learning how to trace, write their name. Mm-hmm. Just, just those type of things that we don't even think of with our kids, mm-hmm. but it's kids out there have never been to school. We mm-hmm. potty train, but mm-hmm. it's partners like that when people gift mm-hmm. us with gift cards and stuff that goes a long way. Yes. When they register yes. for parades or participate or donate to any Malone, mm-hmm. like this is what mm-hmm. you're helping. Stuff, mm-hmm. those unrestricted dollars that grants mm-hmm. and stuff don't pay for. Yes, yes, that is so true. And and you spoke to the need yes. as well that, you know, you're serving a highly vulnerable vulnerable population and not always, we can't always put their pictures out because the kids are at right. at risk, you know, e- even of exposure, yeah. you know. And so I'm glad that you're coming on the show to let people know these are the cases that you're dealing with every day of kids who, you know, have been abandoned or the police find them and yeah. they just bring them to your center mm-hmm. 24 hours a day, anytime. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. Yep. So that's why mm-hmm. we're also mm-hmm. looking to expand our crisis center because we yeah. constantly have a, it's constantly full mm-hmm. and it tells me that the need is great and we have to pivot to meet that need. But then those stories mm-hmm. and those testimonies yes. are powerful. You never know who you're mm-hmm. helping that's and true. in what capacity. If we mm-hmm. get kids, sometimes they don't have shoes on their feet. Yeah. And mm-hmm. it, it's about $159 mm-hmm. to keep a kid overnight in a crisis care in a safe environment. You mm-hmm. never know what they run running from or anything right. like that. I had, it was one mm-hmm. time a mother walk came up and she had on like some shorts and some mm-hmm. stiletto heels and a nice mm-hmm. shirt and two little boys. Mm-hmm. It wasn't my place to judge her right. at all. Right. That maybe that's right. all she had mm-hmm. before she ran from wherever she was coming from. That's all that's she true. had to grab. Mm-hmm. Or true. maybe she is going somewhere else and bringing the kids. Up. But guess what? The kids are safe. That's They're right. not at home alone, around mm-hmm. guns or mm-hmm. fire or nothing. Mm-hmm. I've had mm-hmm. people come up there and they see me and they know me from uh, school, high school mm-hmm. or college or something like that. And they mm-hmm. drop their head. I'm like, no, nah, don't mm-hmm. drop your head. Hold mm-hmm. your head up. Right. I never know when I may need mm-hmm. these services That's and true. it's confidential. Mm-hmm. That's the piece about you just talked about. It's confidential yes. because it's their story. It's not mine. I can That's give you true. testimonies, but mm-hmm. I pe- I can't always put people in front of a camera. That's mm-hmm. their story. And yes. would you want your story told? But just know mm-hmm. you helping somebody. It mm-hmm. could be your neighbor, your cousin mm-hmm. or anybody. You're yeah. helping a family. You're helping kids. And like mm-hmm. I say, it's stuff that people don't people mm-hmm. don't understand. It's unrestricted. We have to pay for a lot of parents are fighting to get their kids back from the system for whatever mm-hmm. reason. They may not even be non-offending parents. Right. But the lawyers mm-hmm. going to court, mm-hmm. transportation to get there. It's things like yes. that. The cost of eggs and milk went up. Try mm-hmm. feeding a ton of kids that way. And people, right. off, you know, people that's coming mm-hmm. to service, like our price go up too. But right. what we do mm-hmm. it's just, it's impactful, it's powerful. Yes. And, and it's God's mm-hmm. assignment. I feel like mm-hmm. I'm on. Yes. He, he said... Mm -hmm. He never said it was going to be easy. He said, trust him. And that's what I do. That is, that is so true. And and you do that so well. And so as we speak to the needs of the agency, Mm -hmm. what, what do you all need to be successful at Annie Malone? To be successful at Annie Malone, the Mm -hmm. need Mm -hmm. is more so the funding, it's the resources, Mm -hmm. it's the resources. Mm -hmm. Um, I I got a call the other day, someone had looked at the needs that was outside for Lysol and stuff, and we had a shipment coming, Mm -hmm. and uh, Procter & Gamble does a Mm -hmm. shipment, but but it's more the dollars that pay Mm -hmm. for stuff like that we don't, we're not able to get. So when you out shop, I tell people, when you're out shopping for your Mm -hmm. own child or whatever, go over to that clearance rack. Mm -hmm. If it's winter time and you see some shorts on sale, some Nike shorts, 
get those five dollar shorts because mm-hmm. shopping all season is cheaper but right. we always need that kids come to us and they don't mm-hmm. have yes. the season about to change school's mm-hmm. about to be out but also mm-hmm. the experience if yes. you're in a position where you can you can donate mm-hmm tickets to the Cardinals or a hockey game or skating or something or movies like this mm-hmm. is stuff that that we would love to take the kids to but also mm-hmm. the donations with the funding that pays for gas maintenance different mm-hmm. things like that our, our uh, car was stolen from mm-hmm. the crisis center right. now we have mm-hmm. to try to we have to get a new mm-hmm. car things mm-hmm. like that when we have floods bedding yes. mm-hmm. so those unrestricted dollars but more so the mm-hmm. funds help us expand our services right the, mm-hmm. that you can't really mm-hmm. say i need this this and this but when mm-hmm. you give more money now mm-hmm. i got extra funding to take that extra kid that family of five mm-hmm. or that family of four or or when a grandmother goes into um into the hospital for surgery or something. She's a caretaker for her grandchild. Right. We keep mm-hmm. her in, keep the grandchild mm-hmm. in the same school mm-hmm. clothes, make sure everything is fine, take her up there to see the grandmother, everything. Mm-hmm. Those extra dollars when that mm-hmm. when they run out, that's what that helps. Yes. So yes. the funding that the funding mm-hmm. that comes through and the donations, mm-hmm. that mm-hmm. takes us a long way. Mm-hmm. It's mm-hmm. it's easy to when well, we're out of yes. units or we're a full bed. No, I can mm-hmm. do that if I get the funding, I can do more. Okay. Children experiencing trauma often look for a safe place to call home. At Annie Malone Children and Family Services, we take care of kids in crisis. Our compassionate staff become like family, sometimes for only a day and sometimes for much longer. When you donate to Annie Malone, you are making a difference in the lives of kids in the St. Louis community. So please give to Annie Malone today at AnnieMalone.com to help our children reach their destiny. And of course, we know we're coming up on yes. the largest fundraiser of the yes. year, the yes. May Day Parade. Yes. The May Day Parade. Yeah. So yes, it's speak exciting. Speak to all of that that's it's going exciting. on, right? <laughs> it's exciting because mm-hmm. of the culture and it's mm-hmm. us and everything mm-hmm. and everybody coming together. We have Nike mm-hmm. back for the second year in a row. Mm-hmm. It was Bank back for the second year. Yes. Procter and Gamble, White Castle. We're doing mm-hmm. a roundup at the register. Yes. Anything like that, right? There. Yes. Ooh. Yes. But the sponsorships mm-hmm. are, um, and then also registration for the parade. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We're doing that, and those funds again. Mm-hmm. This is our largest fundraiser for unrestricted dollars. Yes, that yes. helps so mm-hmm. much. Yes, and, and we know sometimes when it comes to parade registration, people tend to wait to the last minute. No, don't yes. wait to the last minute. I say yes. get your registration in mm-hmm. now because mm-hmm. we're starting lineup. This mm-hmm. is how, as a, as the mm-hmm. registrations come in, that's how we start the lineup. We mm-hmm. got to have a certain, mm-hmm. you know, band here and a band there, and then a cart. Like we have to do that. Mm-hmm. But that first band that sign up is gonna be in first. That first right. card that sign up is mm-hmm. gonna be right there. The first group like that. Yes. And we yes. have a number of different mm-hmm. registrations. We have three levels mm-hmm. of registration that people mm-hmm. can participate in. Also, we have mm-hmm. small business and nonprofit. Um, special offers and sponsorships mm-hmm. this time mm-hmm. the vendor area i love the vendor area yes i love yes. it i want to mm-hmm. see all the boutiques mm-hmm. out there people that do lashes you know come out get right. a vendor right. get yes. a vendor table mm-hmm. talk about your business mm-hmm. be proud of what you're doing yes. and i think you know mm-hmm. in marketing and advertisement mm-hmm. for mm-hmm. the dollar amount mm-hmm. that goes a long way you're see, you're does. getting in front of thousands mm-hmm. of people for mm-hmm. a minimal fee that you would have mm-hmm. had to pay a lot for. So I love seeing us and I love to see young mm-hmm. entrepreneurs and African American mm-hmm. entrepreneurs like come out, yes. get the word out about what you do. But more mm-hmm. importantly, I love to see the kids. Yes. Like I remember mm-hmm. being in a parade and it was mm-hmm. my time to show out in front of my family right, and my right. friends. Like I love seeing the yes. schools and the sororities because mm-hmm. this gets you hype about mm-hmm. college. Mm-hmm. That type of stuff and yes. all the radio stations and mm-hmm. news people that you really only see through the TV. That you know true. that you know I love that is true. I it just, is. I it's it's it. a great parade. It, it really is. I mean, the energy, the culture of yes. it is just exciting. You know, downtown is a beautiful yes. venue. It's safe. You yep. know, we, we had a great time, mm-hmm. you know. And We're back in front of Channel 5. Back in front but of Channel 5. But that registration helps with the un- unrestricted dollars, mm-hmm. but it also helps us mm-hmm. keep putting on the parade. Yes. It's not it's not cheap to put on a parade of that mm-hmm. magnitude. It's not. Yes. So yes. when you mm-hmm. register, that's how we help put on the parade and mm-hmm. help fund the program. Yes. It's important. Yes. So if you want to see the Magic Parade every year, register. Mm-hmm. Right. Right. Cause that's, you know, right. that's, Cause that's important that pocket of money yeah. to help put on that parade. And, and it's the oldest parade in the country. Yep. 
you know and so when i look at black culture and historic black culture yes you think of like the ebony fashion fair you know that mm -hmm. went away you know different things that have gone away over the years mm -hmm. we don't ever want the annie malone mayday no. parade to go away not even if it's at, it's not even at risk of it but y'all still need to support it okay mm -hmm. <laughs> they yeah. still need to support it they um the deadline the deadline is april yeah. the 30th mm -hmm. not may 1st not yeah. May 2nd, April the 30th. And the yes. reason the deadline mm -hmm. is April the 30th is because so mm -hmm. much go into this parade. And we mm -hmm. want to make sure the logistics behind mm -hmm. the scenes is just, you know, buttoned up for everybody. Mm -hmm. I do feedback sessions mm -hmm. after the parade every year. And when I get that feedback, I do something with it, right? Mm -hmm. So that's why the deadline is April the 30th because okay. we want to make ensure efficiency okay. in the parade. Mm -hmm. just, you know, we want to make sure mm -hmm. we do right, right. by everybody. Right. So we're going to mm -hmm. do that. That sounds great. And how, how can one register and find out more information about the parade or how to donate to Annie yes. Malone? Yes, they can go mm -hmm. to www.anniemalone.com mm -hmm. on their homepage. You can scroll mm -hmm. down and there's a countdown to the red, to the parade. Right. And right up under it says register now. You click that link. It'll take you to a race roster page. That's our page. Mm -hmm. And you can register for the parade there to become a participant, a vendor, mm -hmm whatever is on that page. And also you can donate to Annie Malone on that page. Mm -hmm. Or when you go to www.anniemalone.com, there's that big red button that says yes. donate. Okay. Yes. All right. All right. Yes. Well, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank Keisha. you. Just, just <laughs> letting people know you're the, I consider you the conscious of our community. <laughs> you know, I do. I really do. It's the conscious of the community yeah. because if you're not taking care of the children of the community, what are you really doing? Because nope. our children are our destiny. Yep. You know, so we got to take care of the kids. And how do you take care of the kids? By supporting Annie, Annie Malone. Malone. Yeah, so yes. thank you so much. Thank and you. Yeah, best wishes and prayers and hopes for you and Annie Malone. Thank you. Okay. Good. <laughs> yeah. Yay, thank good. you. Of course, of course.